Hey there. So I've decided to use my lathe to make myself a carbide fly cutter. And uh, I'm going to start by uh, cutting a piece of 60 millimeter long uh, and 50 millimeter wide steel, uh, round steel. And then I'm going to turn it so it gets a shaft of 25 millimeters wide and 30 millimeters long. And the milling part will be 25 millimeters long and 45 wide. And then I'm going to take an end mill and uh, come in this way to mill a slot uh, where my carbide carbide uh, tool will go. And I'm also going to have to drill and tap a hole in that. So uh, nothing more to it. Let's let's get to it. And uh, I'll start by cutting uh, cutting a piece of steel to use for it.
it's just uh, some milling and uh, drilling and tapping so uh, what I'm gonna do now is to use this uh, attachment for my lathe to uh, to mount my piece in the uh, in the tool holder and I can do some milling I've set this in height so that the bottom of the mill will cut uh, in the center line of the workpiece. So when I mount my uh, my carbide, it will go a couple of millimeters up, which it will give it a little angle when it's rotating. Uh, so my workpiece is in my tool holder, and my mill is in the chuck, and. Uh, I've set this to an angle of uh, about 18 degrees here. Uh, it seems like 15 to 20 degrees seems to work good. I haven't tried anything else, so it might, wor might work with other angles. It's more a, a question of getting your carbide to fit in a good way in the, in the mill. Okay, so we're last down to the last uh, pass, and uh, I'm just uh, taking clearing pass here to uh, get a nice finish. Now we're just going to move the workpiece down a little bit so I can cut cut out this this section here this should be in. So I think it have, I have it set right there. Uh, this seems to be pretty crucial to get this hole right. But I think it's pretty much perfect there. Just gonna barely touch it. Now I'm gonna take my carbide and check to see that I'm on center. That looks very good. to do now is to fit the, the carbide and then take it for a test spin. Perfect. Thank you. 
when it's working properly you can get something like this and I hope you can see that not bad at all I think so thanks for watching uh, I'd love it if you click the like button and sub subscribe to my channel as well so uh, take care bye